All I noticed, I was in here digging out fucking caterpillars and shit because as you see, they're nailing me. Yeah. I just noticed his tail there. Just at the top here. Oh. And here's what I thought it'd be. Yeah. Do you know what it yeah, is? Who wants to oh, catch that one? Me, I want that one. Can I take a photo? Right? Yeah, man. Yeah. We can send you this too if you want. Oh, that'd be great, yeah. Do you know what it is? You said a green tree snake, right? No, I was thinking it could be at first or even a brown tree, but this oh, is a baby. very baby coastal carpet python. Oh, beautiful. So this is right on time. I think this is our very first little hatchling. Oh, sorry. Is it? You won't hit. No, I didn't want to squash him. Yeah, I know. They're very delicate. <laughs> So he's hardly got a pattern yet. Yeah, I know. So it's yeah. pretty much a newborn. Wow. So this time of year, we do start to see all the yeah, very yeah. like, because most of the time people say it's a baby snake when they're still like a foot or two long. Yeah, of course. But yeah. an actual baby, this is a true baby carpet python. So this thing, I mean, 95% of these will end up eaten by birds and that in the first oh, few weeks. Yeah, yeah. But say it's the one of the ones that actually survive, it can grow to four meters long, that thing. Really? But usually two and a half to three meters is a good size for okay. a full grown adult. And yeah, what's it, nice what spot. would bring it into our broccoli? What, what's it in here chasing? Oh, well at this stage, it, they pretty much eat like little lizards oh, and yeah. things that they can yeah, catch, yeah, but they yeah. will convert to rodents as they, they grow. Yeah, bigger. But, um, so you've probably just got some lizards in the garden, but even just on here, I mean, it, you can even feel the water, so it's got something it can drink. Yeah, well, this it's is nice and safe. Like it's gonna feel dense and yeah. thick and protected, so it's in between those leaves. So yep. anywhere where it can feel safe and like it's not gonna end up food, yeah, it will be ideal because you get a lot of them around. Mm -hmm. So what happens is they have about, oh, on average, like let's say about twenty eggs yeah. per clutch. Yeah, um, they're not always all viable, but but say say they have twenty. Yeah. Um, they'll all disperse, so they all got to go their own way and find their own thing, so yeah, they don't yeah, stay yeah. with each other or with mum and dad or, no, or nothing. Course, so, yeah. so they all just got to. He might have just been born not far away, and just, he's come across here and gone. This looks alright. Yeah. 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 down. It's Normally, fine. it's the real big ones that you get in your veggie yeah. patch. Yeah, it's going to be a beautiful looking snake. Yeah. So it's pretty much. That's why you're thinking, yeah, like it could be a brown tree snake or something, and. Uh, yeah, because yeah. obviously yeah, it's fully it hasn't got its colors yet. nah like yeah. it's a real orangey color so that it's... over time it's going to get like it's going to go much darker and have that real prominent pattern so it'll be a dark brown snake with the light brown colors yeah, yeah it's blodge he's plus isn't he yeah it is pretty nice sometimes the little babies are very scared and can give you a nip but if they nip it doesn't Obviously, it's non venomous and not too bad. Yeah. But you're doing the right thing, man. If you're not sure, then don't muck around. Uh, That's what we more, say to people. I, I'm more about wanting to keep him safe, you know what I mean? Like, well, I appreciate yeah, that. Yeah, 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 for sure. I don't want to see him get hurt or anything. Got some and awesome have, photos um, of this too that I can send you as well. Oh, great. Just just remind me in case I forget. Yeah, yeah. Because that's a wicked shot right there. Yeah, cool. So. We um we have quite a few kookaburra.